Hello, can I see here? Can. Come alone, lor. Yes. Hmm. Let. You want to play game, ba? Can. Five, no, ten. no, no, no. Five, ten. Okay. Five, ten. We lose. Hey. Her one. Huh? Wow. Today I must make you drunk, nah. Don't forget, nah. Later, five to zero on stage. You don't make me drunk, lah. I can't remember. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Drunk already, yeah. we will speak fake, then go toilet all. Oh, oh go toilet, oh, don't have any problem. Is it? I different. Ting lah. Ting. Every time say like that, then make us drunk first. Can okay, lah, you see later. <laughs> okay, so for today's episode, we have uh, Kun Mil with us. And for those who don't know, Kun Mil is actually quite popular on the internet recently uh, because her videos went viral on internet because of our TikTok videos, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so um, today we are going to sit down with her to find out more about who she is and why did she go viral on the internet? Yeah, we will be asking some questions that a lot of you want to know. Yeah, so do make sure you stay tuned to the whole video to find out who Kun Miu is. So Kun Miu, yeah, how old are you? <laughs> it's a million dollar question. Everybody <laughs> want to know my age. Yeah, why? Why? Ah? Why? Nah, like, like, so cute. Ah. Yeah, very cute. <laughs> That's why we need to know your age. Yeah, okay, how old you think I am? Um, from the vibe, from everything. Twenty-five. No, ka. No. Every day my birthday. Every day your birthday. Wow. This year I just turned eighteen only, na ka. Wow. Oh my god. Eighteen. Forever eighteen, na ka. Every time I'm on stage, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, na. So good. Every day. Every day my birthday. Chai. So many birthday cake, yeah. Chai. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, my age is eighteen. You believe? Okay. You believe? Don't believe? Call out there. <laughs> so we can't really dig out the actual answer from her. All right. Are you Thai or Singaporean? Oh. My That's very confusing. Eh? <laughs> you like you can speak English. Mm. Your Thai also very good. Mm. Your Chinese also good. Mm. Wow. Confused. Melu. Melu ni mai. Okay. So uh, now I am a Singaporean who are Ping Ai Si because uh, I have. Husband here, no lah. Oh. <laughs> may try, may try, may try. <laughs> Let me bring the car. Anybody want to sign up? Ah? <laughs> <laughs> keep ready, keep ready. <laughs> okay. Um, I am a. I born in Thai. Then I came at around five years old and whatnot. Then okay. then uh, I brought up as a Thai lah. You know, at home I speak Thai and then I have friends in Thai. Then my mother. Mm, your hand move also very yeah, Thai. <laughs> very Thai. <laughs> we can can die na. I can na. Mo lam. <laughs> cannot, I cannot. Cannot. <laughs> okay. Then after that, uh, my mother just let me like go to school, learn my English, Chinese, you know, mm. at home. But at home, you're Thai. Oh, okay, yeah, okay. So that's how, that's how I know English, Chinese, and everything, lah. Mm. Mm, correct. So, uh, my answer is, I'm born in Thailand. I hope being <laughs> I see now, mm, my heart is Thai. So am I. Uh, I also don't know. Still very, <laughs> still very confusing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> What were you doing before COVID? Um, before COVID, ah, those people party at night, you know, na. You see my eye, ah, bling. Oh, okay, I see. You know, ba? Ah, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit. Ah, hmm. Got like that, lah. Okay. Tang, why not? Everything he asks, I give them. Everything she don't want to answer me at all. Jala the interview. Why you suddenly start doing TikTok videos? Hmm. Why I suddenly started doing TikTok videos? So, uh, I just wanted to be a bit educational because mm. it's always something. The TikTok video of Thai disco, right? That you all see, right? That went viral ever. Mm. Um, it wasn't intentional. I was doing it out of fun, and actually, I only wanted to um. Tell people how I felt last time, mm. okay? Um, and then I want people who party at night to know the concept and the truth of how we feel. Mm. You get what okay. I mean? But then not tra- not not to put it in a way that it will be offensive for people who party. That okay. that is why I also add my character into it and humor into it. You know what I mean? Mm. If it's too like straight cut, then people will be like, oh. What the fuck? You know, like you try to say, "Wow, we know money hang out." You know what I mean? Mm. Yeah. So I want to be educational about it and funny in a way. And it turns out that you know the audience and all like took it as a joke. You know what I mean? Quite well yeah, received, yeah, yeah. I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I'm pretty sure I put my message out there very clearly. Mm. You know about the wow, one swipe. Why do I want to hang flower now? That kind of thing. 
Mm, yeah. Mm, and then I feel that I, I also voice out for all the nightclub entertainers out there. Mm -hmm. okay. You know that they 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 couldn't stay out because if we, they stay out, then like we lose customers, mah. You know, mm. you're not. Mm. True. When customers yeah. know what you already think, then they might. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Correct. So I just posted a video, you know, uh, and then in the blink of an eye, like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Become famous. Oh, uh, why like that? You know what I mean? Why like that? Yeah, so it wasn't uh, intentional actually by right. Mm. Then now that I see that like, people really enjoy it and all this, then I try to come up with contents with my own on, with my own character and all that, you know? Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Yeah. So the first time you saw my TikTok video, how do you feel? And well, now become interview me. Interview him also. Because <laughs> <laughs> I want to know, you know, like, is it okay. offensive or, or what, you know? Uh, first time I saw your videos, uh, frankly speaking, I mean, um, because I'm not really those who really go yeah, yeah. Uh, Thai nightlife and so good on. Tidy. <laughs> oh, good boy, uh, good boy. Uh, yeah. So, um, so it's very eye-opening to me to mm -hmm. see how how the whole industry is like. Uh, I mean, from your point of view, mm -hmm. as well as the guy point of mm -hmm. view. Yeah. So to me, it's really very interesting. I think to some people, the impression of nightlife is not really positive. Mm. So what do you think is the actual, actually a real impression of nightlife? And and why do people misinterpret you as like, it's mm. a bad thing or something? Okay, um, I have quite a bit to say, okay? Mm. So people usually like think that, oh, little this girl come five minutes, 10 minutes, you know, like, I hang her for a while, later she won't come back anymore. You know what I mean? Mm. In nightlife, for those people who, party a lot. Mm. So um, I only want to say that before you step into this zone, this Thai disco, this door, you already know it's a Thai disco, right? You already know it's a Thai disco. Yeah. The culture is hanging flower, right? Mm. So um, people usually go in there to have a motive. To have like you know like I'm going to I'm going to go there and find love. I'm going to there to find a marriage. Mm, mm, mm. But actually if you think about it is we are here to work. Am I right? We're yes. here to work, we're on stage to work. We're not on stage to be like, tin, like Tinder, you know, like, I on mm. stage, mix, mix and match. Ah. <laughs> wow, love, it mix and match, at least I act better, ma. Sorry, sorry. So, right? mm. so, yeah, so people should like, put that in their head that, you know, we are entertainers. Entertainers, everything comes with a price. Mm. Everything yes. that you do, nothing is free on this world. Mm. So, our job, everybody's job scope is different. Example, like, um, Maybe a chef, the, the job scope is what is to cook for you, yes, right? Yes. But entertainer means entertainer. We entertain, we get the money, right? Mm. We don't entertain and then get, get, get nothing, then we drink for what? Drink at home lah! Kim Ti Wan, Chi Ka, And then like, guy, uh, everybody like, think that, you know, um, we only want money and whatnot. But actually, right, uh, firstly, of course, we want money lah. If not, we can't work for what? <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, you're there to work, right? Yes, yeah. and then, but, um, how to say this? Uh, how do I put this? But then, if you are good to us, you know, we build a friendship. We can be friends forever. One, there's mm. a lot of like samples and customer be friends for, have a f strong friendship for like ten over years. There's a lot, you know. But then, if you destroy her, then mm. it's another or like try to touch her and whatever, right? Then it's a different story, really. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, and then. We Thai disco people, right? We come out to work and then we look very happy because this is our job. Mm, yeah. We are, supposed, you happy, right? we are supposed to make <laughs> yeah. you happy. We are supposed to make you happy. It cannot be you come here for the night, then are there like, hello? Can be a man? You happy? Man? Very sad, very sad. <laughs> very sad, right? yeah. So when we come to work, we actually look happy because mm. it is our job. Mm. But then actually, when we are drunk all this by like, by you guys, you know, like, um, <laughs> it is our job to drink, lah, okay? Mm. It's our job to drink, but actually, we are very sad because, like, we have, you know, those kind of people, like, um, really pure Thai, pure Vietnamese, pure China, or whatever, they are, they have their own struggles at home. Okay. It's not the yeah. same economy as Singapore, you know? They are mm. earning money every day, drinking their life away just to, like, send money back to Thailand mm. and Vietnam and whatever. So, yeah, then some people who go Thai disco, they will, like, say, like, um, we are cheating money and whatever. But honestly, right, this is what we do. Mm. This is life. I mean, I'm, I'm being very honest here. This is life, you know. And then um, it takes two hands to clap. Lah. Yeah, you know, it's those like people, a mutual understanding. Like, you yeah. want to come here to 
be entertained and then yes. you get entertainment then you don't yes, pay yes, for yes, it. Yes. Right? And then there's a lot of times that um, customers come, right? And then a the customer will like say, why I need to hang her? Mm. You know, like, why I need to hang her? Can you give me a reason to hang her? The, the answer is very straight cut. You know, we are working, mm. right? We are working, right? Yeah, so people don't understand that. That is very, very sickening. This is why mm. I put it in the video, like, some, because I met myself, you know, that, those kind of customers that come over. Now that they, like, um, order a lot of beer and mm -hmm. whatever, it's okay not to hang. Some people, like, mm. don't have the... Mm money or whatever, it's okay. okay. Mm. It's no wrong, guys, no wrong. Ah. Don't go over there shoot me, eh? Yeah, <laughs> it's no wrong. But then, when you when you know you're not going to hang and then mm. make it worth our health, right? We are, okay, Jiang Nan Ting Yi Dian, okay? We are selling our health. We are selling our kidney, our liver, all the things. We are selling our time, everything comes with a price, I say. Mm. And some people, like, don't take the initiative to tell the girl, like, hey, I'm not going to hang. Mm. You know, I'm not going to hang. But, and then they and still then want to party. talk yeah. with you, yeah, drink yeah, with you, correct. force you to drink. Yeah, correct. Force you to drink, and then okay. play until you are very happy, very happy. But he already knows. 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 I mean, to the girl, it's like a waste of time. Like, it is a waste yeah. of time. Woman, we only have, like, example, we're on stage, like, maybe, like, um, what time? 10 p.m. We mm. end, like, 3 a.m., let's say. Mm. We only have that. Then we're in your chair, we're in your chair. It's a very, very long time. You know what I mean? We nightlife people, actually, we are very, very good people. We're very nice people, you know. Um, we really take care of people, you know. Mm. But obviously, if you... You do bad thing to us, like why this? Why I need to mm. take care of you? Yeah, you know what I mean. Okay, I saw in your TikTok videos, right? You mentioned that some guys when they go to Thai, Thai disco, they sort of put in a lot of real feeling. Is it? Mm -mm. What is your thought about it? My thought about it is um, never ever come to this place with a motive. Never ever, always have that strong mindset that okay, I'm going to have fun tonight. Mm. I'm going in there to like just okay tonight. I'm going to hang like maybe five hundred. Then that's it. I'm gonna have fun with her and all this. She's an entertainer. Mm. She sings song nice. All this wah. Wow. Then oh, like yo, oh, then say yo, say yo. Now then, <laughs> then all that, go supper or whatever, up to y'all. Then mm -hmm. go home. Then that's it. Mm. This is nightlife, you know. But okay. if you're lucky, I mean, like you can meet your love of your life. Ah, there are couples that you know met mm. and then they okay. really last very long. But those that always keep having that same mistake, you know, I I suggest. Mm. And I hope that you all learn that um, Thai Disco is a place where we all entertainers are earning money. Mm. We are not here to Tinder here, Tinder there, mix and match, co coffee miss beggar, mm. no, 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 no. <laughs> wrong concept. Ah. <laughs> yeah, this is the thing I want to say. So okay. all my friends who go and party, I always tell them, say, don't go there with a motive. You know, go there because you want to have fun. Mm. Go there, you want to have fun and spend money. Not you know, to find a girlfriend there. Not, mm. not to find a girlfriend there. Mm. Okay, but if, like I say, if you're lucky, you know, you mm. meet. But mm. if you're unlucky, then, you know, you know, next time, don't have a motive. Mm. You okay. know what I mean? Mm, correct. Yeah. And always know the culture of Thai disco hanging flower is we are earning money. Mm. You know? Mm. But I understand and I know some of y'all will comment, say that, but the girl come sweet talk me all this, right? Confirm mm. I will have one, right? Firstly is, um, you smart enough or not? Ah? <laughs> <laughs> mm, this is you Okay. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Like I said, like, we are selling our health mm. and whatever, right? Yeah. Then some customer, like, they they make fun of the girl, like, uh, mot gel, mot gel, uh, you can map. Like this, then I give you like this, you know. But mm -hmm. some people, they say it, but they don't do it. Okay. You know, and it's not funny at all. You know mm. what I mean? You all, you all understand the feeling of hangover. You all know the feeling of getting drunk and all this, right? Even though we look happy, but we never show. Like I said, mm. like we are yeah. supposed to show the happy side. Mm. But you all know, you all drunk, you all vomit, you all what? You all yeah. don't know. It's a very bad feeling. Yes, you all mm. don't know how many times that we run into the toilet, we vomit first, come out and then smile and laugh to you and say continue. Hey, ma, see, you like me? Because this is our job. Okay. You know, so I really hope to not see people keep doing this. You know what I mean? Because like I said, we are selling our health. Mm. We are selling our liver, our lungs and whatever in exchange of money. Mm. Mm, correct. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I think, I think 
from what I say, it's better for both parties to respect each other. Mm -hmm. I mean, you respect the girl, don't keep forcing her to drink. I mean, it's bad for health and so on, right? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. if you really want to do so much to her, then, I mean, yeah, like price. what Kumil say, mm. then you better hang flower. Yeah, right? it yeah. comes with a price. Because mm. there's a lot of times in uh, nightlife and Thai disco, like, you will see like, uh, when model singer on stage, right? You will see mm. those kind of customer, uh, flower mama, like come and mm. say, hey, you drink 10 seconds, I give you 1,000. Got mm. this kind of customer. This is the kind of customer that know how to play. Okay. You know, like, how much I give you, how much you can give me is I give you. Mm. It's a okay. give and take, um, jeng sing bi sing dong si. So, ma. Correct. So, Nightlife was the first to be cut out of this mm. whole thing because of mm. COVID-19. Mm. So, how did you actually um, pivot what you were doing. Okay, <laughs> okay. So, um, COVID-19 happened, right? Yeah. Then it out of a sudden and all this. Then uh, Malaysia had to close and whatnot. Then after that, um, I came back to Singapore when uh, on the third day of lockdown of Malaysia. So Singapore haven't locked down yet. Oh, okay. Haven't locked down yet. Mm, Malaysia locked first. Yeah, Malaysia locked mm. first. So, uh, it was announced that, you know, if by midnight I don't come out of um, Malaysia, uh, I have to quarantine, whatever. I don't want to quarantine, right? <laughs> now that I, I, I made it out and all this, lah, then I came back. I came back to Singapore with just two weeks of clothes only. Eh. Okay. So my, all my items are still there, you know. Wow. Yeah. Now that I was hoping that two weeks later I go back, but I'm, I'm here <laughs> until now. Lah, you know? I'm here <laughs> until now. So, you see, life, it just... Like happens like that, mm, you know. Yeah, very sudden. Very, very sudden. So, uh, I want to say that nightlife, before I say more, I want to say that nightlife is not sustainable. You know, mm -hmm. it's not sustainable at all. Last time, yes, lah, but when things happen like this, right, it's not sustainable. Yeah, because of COVID 19, it's no longer. Yeah, sustainable. yeah, yeah, correct. Pandemic wise, mm. all this. Uh, okay, so when I come back to Singapore, I have nothing to do, right? Um, uh, I'm not very educated, okay? I printer also don't know how to use. Then I came back to Singapore, I don't know how to use the traffic light also. Because Malaysia is all like... Traffic light? Not. Yeah, traffic really? light. I don't know how to use. <laughs> I came back to Singapore, right? I take pictures sent to my friend and I say, do I press the, the button? Uh, do I cross down? I can't, okay. you know? Mm. That's scary. Then uh, that, um, I forget how to speak English and uh, Singlish. I Not like this. Okay, like. okay. It's like really some Malaysia uh, Then other Then uh, that, I slowly pick up back my singlish and you know uh, you, when you are, you blend into a place really you yeah. become that person yeah, right? yeah, yeah. then after that I didn't know what to do then uh, I rested for three months you know I mm. stay at home I just exercise and whatnot like normal I just wanted to rest mm. because like, I've been drinking for very long already I just mm. want to rest okay now that I I I find a job mm. a packer uh -huh. A packer in a, in a factory? factory. Okay, okay. In a warehouse. So it's like six dollars per hour only. To me, right? Mm. Even though last time like you know, singer, whatever, like <laughs> but then <laughs> now it's like like this, right? To big, me it's big drop. Yeah, to me it's it, it does not affect me. To me it's like if I have that one dollar, two dollar now I earn, mm. I will still take it. Okay. You know, it doesn't matter if I will earn one million today mm. or Today I earn one dollar. Mm. The big difference. I won't feel affected. No, mm. it's still money. Yeah, you know mm. I mean. And then it's how you change your life as the time goes. Mm. How yeah. how do I rephrase that? Something like that, right? Um, yeah. mm. How you how you move forward to be a better. Yeah. 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 With the situation, yeah. lah. You know, you don't you don't. I also want to say to everybody that don't because of like a situation, then you like wait for the time and then like be stuck with it you know like time does not wait for anybody mm, yeah. you have to follow with the time yes. all right last time you last time i can live a atas life you know i can live a uh, how to say like a uh what today i'm by mcm i go by mcm mm, you know wow. like you can you can you know but now it's like um i don't mm. and it's not a problem for me okay, okay? so i like, like i said i became a packer in mm. a warehouse pack, pack very hot very what you know no aircon wow. <laughs> <laughs> no aircon no anything wow. then obviously it's a different change right then my my body clock also change okay body clock also change some you are a very night person yeah yeah, and then yeah, now yeah daytime person yeah it took me like two okay. weeks for my body to like um 
adjust wow. lah. Mm. Very, very, very simple. Okay. But I never give up. You know, I just go and work the warehouse, push the very, very, the very a lot of thing. You know, I just do it. Then stand the whole day. You know. Mm. Then after that, I I become a customer service for a company. Mm. I wouldn't say. Then after that, I customer service. Then I learn how from a customer service. I get to learn a bit of computer, ma. Mm. You know, like Microsoft Excel, Microsoft Word, and PowerPoint. Okay. And for a generation nowadays, for y'all, it's like who does not know, right? But I only learned it during pandemic. Recently, la. Yeah, mm, recently. Okay. So when I stare in the computer. I will go blank because my brain is not practiced, ma. Mm. You know, last time it's ma, very foreign to you, right? You don't know. Yeah, how to yeah, use yeah. That. I don't know. Then my I had to learn how to use printer. All this is very, very difficult for me at, at the start. You know, but I told mm. myself that I told myself that I'm already here. You know, mm. I should just learn it and then like go all the way. I should tell one one. So I learn and whatever, and then and then I never knew that I will use it for good use today, <laughs> which means like mm. uh, I started to do my uh, bun business. It's called Melukonom. I don't know if some of you all heard before. You know, it's like an inspired Jawarat um, yeah. ban. But yeah, it's inspired. It's not very same, but it's my concept is more like a uh, you dip your uh, your ban with the leftover the, sauce. Yeah, sauce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Correct. Then what does Melukonom mean? Oh, Melukonom means Me is a mother in Thai. Mm. Uh, Luk is the the, the kid. You know, okay. yeah, my child. Okay. Kanom is you know a snack, snack mm. sweet, uh, this kind of thing. Mm. Yeah, I named it Melu Kanom is because firstly, of course, I love my mother a lot. Like Mama. Then I always remember from from a kid until now, right? My mother always like hold my hands and tell me, mm. like, say that one day we will walk out of this house together. You know, she always tell me. So mm -hmm. everything that I do in my life. Um, mm. Is is for her, okay. you know what mm. I mean? Yeah, because our dream is always to get out of that house, you know. Yeah, so so my kanom, whenever I do the kanom, right? Actually, mm. I I do it with love and pain, you know. Yeah, I do it with love and pain. Yeah, I saw you stir also a lot of love and pain. Right? <laughs> Your hands also very pain. My hand also very pain. Ah. don't say only my heart. Ah. my hand pain. Ah. <laughs> I stay for sixteen hours, you no know, guys. Mm. I I do I do alone and all this. Yeah, but. To be when I'm tired, right? I always mm. tell myself that, hey, last time you know, like kampung people, mm -hmm. or um, those kind like Thailand kampung people, talat nat pasar malam that kind, right? Mm. All the uncle auntie so old also can wake up 3 a.m. in the morning also can wake up do sure. the yeah. fresh stuff. Why I cannot do? Mm. Is it because I'm new generation? No ma, mm. it's still the same. Yeah. Right. So I just like, yeah, do I just lo. do it. Yeah. I just do it, lor. Yeah. And then I chose why I chose the yawarat. Ban kind of mm. style is because I am a person who like colorful stuff lah. Then you see like, eh, Thai milk tea, Thai green tea, blah It's mm. pink, green, blah blah, all the bombastic color, right? Mm. Now they're like, oh, I should just do it lah. Then nobody do it yet so much, so I just do it. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. I want to say that um, support me, na ka. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those who are watching, you can find her on IG, right? Yes, yeah. man, look her on Facebook. Yes, mm. I think yeah, leave it something. Yeah, here. oh here. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and another question which a lot of viewers are asking. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not excited. Do you know? <laughs> <laughs> so the question is, are you attached? <laughs> um, am I attached? Mm. Wow, million dollar question. We have yeah, two million, million dollar million. question. <laughs> um, okay, am I attached or not? I think a lot of people know I have a lot of boyfriend. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I think I love you, no? Mm. Ah, yeah, you know, kick you. I love you, lah. Super star, you know. <laughs> yeah, super star is one. Super star. Yeah, again, ah, all the question he asks is like, I not gonna answer. I'm sure all of you want to know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I always like to keep people in curiosity, ah. Yeah. More oh, fun, ah. Okay. You know, like keep you in suspense, oh, like, okay. cause if you know everything about me, right? I'm boring. Already. Yeah, boring. Yeah, right? I know. Yeah. yeah, no, don't have to like that, ah. Mm. Mm. I like to play fishing, ah. Tarik, ah. Oh, keep people in suspense, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. It's in the blood. Okay, okay. It's in the blood one. I see. <laughs> so, do you have any last message for our followers or your followers? Mm -mm -mm. Yeah. I want to tell everybody out there that mm. uh, whoever like struggling during pandemic, right? I just want to say that there's a lot of things to do out there mm. if you really want to do it. And I feel that uh, anybody can reach their dreams if they really work to it. It's whether you wake up, tidy your bed, and then get straight to it. 
Mm. Or you just wake up, start using your phone, and then do nothing productive at all in a day. No, you can actually spend your time like sitting down and then like finding something to do. Honestly, yeah. true. You true. know, yeah. It doesn't mean like now the whole world is like bruh, and then you have to bruh together. You know, mm. yeah. You always can make miracle happen if you want to do it. Yeah, and then for those people who uh. Thai, Thai disco, you know, always go and bully girls and all this. Yeah, hey, Kulu, na. Yeah, hey, Luna, tell go. Um, be more nice, lah. You know, you don't go. For, and then to those people who were, were hurt before in Thai disco, I only have to say that uh, you already know before you step into the place that this is what kind of place, mm. right? So always have that strong, strong mindset, lah. Mm. So thank you so much, Kumil, for coming down today and mm. telling us about your story and sharing with us uh, your inspirations and yeah yeah actually right the truth is right i keep pushing every youtube right one month later i mean one month later that time you know why i was that time i was gaining weight very rabbi you know? oh, okay. and then i was like oh give me time to get back to my weight like you know then that, down. yeah then actually i was skinnier now that uh but yesterday i went to eat dessert then i like then i push for it then I tell myself, I stop pushing, I just come, you know what I mean? Cannot push already. <laughs> Cannot push already. Too long already. Yeah. Yeah, 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 just do it, just do it. Just do it, just yeah, do it. Like what Kun will say, if you are having a problem, just just find the best out of yeah, it yeah. and just do it. Just do yeah. it. Okay, thank you for hey, watching. You. See you, bye-bye. Bye-bye.